So now let's see how we can work around with Bevel Alpha and Bevel S effect inside of Adobe Premiere Elements. So to uh, uh, apply out Bevel Alpha and Bevel S's, you need to go around under effects right here and you can see that Bevel Alpha is an option. So if I were to go around and click and drag that out right here, then you can see that I can go around and change around the S thickness and you can see that the Bevel Alpha effect actually gets applied. You can change around the light angle over here as well and even choose the light color as you like. You can also go around and take the color picker right here and choose a color from the footage right here so that it more matches out um, the feel of the footage itself. And you can also go around and change around the light intensity as you can see this like this. So that is how you can apply out bubble offer. So let me just go around and delete it. And the other effect that you have is bubble edges right here. So if I were to go around and click and drag this out right here, then you can see that bevel edges is applied. You can go around and change around the edge thickness as you can see this like this. And you can also go around and change around the light angle as you can see right here. And choose the light color over here just like this as well. So let's just go around over here and choose the light color. And this is what you have. You can go around and change around the angle. And you can change around the intensity of the uh, um, uh, of the light as well, just like this. So that is how you can work around with Bubble Alpha and Bubble as effect inside of Adobe Premiere Elements. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.